Center. We still have to deal with the old water lines, sewer lines, drain lines, cow brook, parking facilities, maintenance, roads, lighting, etc. All the utilities are old. This project will pay for those when the city buys them back. It's very unique, it's a different approach. For many years, cities would spend millions on infrastructure and hope somebody comes. We're doing the reverse. We're bringing the developer here, we're working the program, and then we buy the garage back, for example, after the 75% occupancy and after the garage of creating enough revenue that will pay for itself. Uh, it's, it's a unique revival program for the Northeast and will make a big difference to the city. So the project, new taxes in that project will carry the infrastructure costs, plus an additional net new growth in our taxes of 2 to $3 million a year, new taxes that come into our budget. It's a win-win for the city. It's a long-term project. It's thousands of jobs, construction jobs, it's thousands of permanent jobs. And as I said, it's a net new tax growth benefit that helps all of us. And in the end, it gives us a downtown we can be proud of. I think the southern end of downtown has really quality has slipped over the years. And uh, it's certainly not marketed, and it's certainly undervalued with all those little one-story buildings along the easterly side of Hancock. We can't do better in this project. We will do better with the center. We're very excited about that project. We've got a great team working on that on a regular basis. Extremely complicated. We'll be back before the council before the end of this year with the final LDA, the land disposition agreement, kind of pulls it all together. And then we hope within two years that the first building, shovel in the ground for the first building, while we're constructing the roadway around, you've seen the McGraw Highway process at the beginning of McGraw, we'll continue the concourse that will connect McGraw Highway over to the parking way leading to Bergen Parkway, which is a huge piece of this. Without that track and traffic improvement, the development wouldn't even be here. So we've got to get that project finished up. It's an exciting program. It's, it's uh, economically, it's so valuable for the future of our city. Uh, and so be it. So with that, and the old saying, a rising tide raises all ships, it helps us market our shipyard. We're currently working right now with a couple of um, Outfits we're trying to steal from Cambridge, and you probably read about the aquarium. Uh, it's got to have a backup facility at the shipyard. We're bringing in some high tech to the shipyard, which I think will begin, begin the process of a new with the shipyard, not building ships, but certainly having a uh, much more value to us, uh, both in taxes, but also aesthetically as it's built out.